Hello and hello from wherever you are. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, welcome. Remember to subscribe. If you've been here, thank you, thank you. We are back. My name is Noni. You can call me Frida. I guess by now you know all my names, which is fine. Fine, just in case you know, you need to send me some cash, some mula. <laughs> anyways welcome back guys i have really missed doing this i've really missed being here but i'm here to just check in quickly update you and also just know how are you guys how have you been coping how are you are you keeping safe oh it's been a lot all right so what has happened okay i blinked and the next thing i was miss at kenya 2020 well that's not exactly how it happened but nothing has been happening how we want it right anyways it has been a journey it was a journey of hard work sacrifices and yeah it paid off and i became miss earth kenya 2020 so i represented kenya at miss earth those who don't know miss earth is an international beauty pageant with an environmental advocacy so it was a two we took two months i guess but now the thing is we were not traveling due to covid everything you know we were supposed to go to philippines but we could not travel and the organization decided not to postpone the event we had to do it virtually so if you don't know what virtually it means it everything had to happen online you know so it was two months november october november and then the finale was to happen on 29th of november so during these two months, it was hectic, I'm telling you. You know, we're in the middle of a pandemic. We had to do submissions of videos, photos, um, catwalk in different areas for the different categories. If it's swimwear, you have to get a, a, a location outside where there's near a beach, maybe at the swimming pool. If it's a um, national costume, you have to do it at a place that has history like a, a museum or something so it was a bit hectic but yeah i do take challenges head on you know if i've always wanted to represent you know my country internationally on an international uh, platform as far as pageants are concerned but if you told me that i'll do that virtually <laughs> i'm sure i'd have laughed myself silly but then yeah that happened and so bakola baby it's on so i took the challenge head on gave it my all i wow it was not easy but we made it and i want to tell you this that no matter the situation no matter where you are if you're presented with a, something a challenge an opportunity embrace it don't even overthink oh how am i going to make it no embrace it and trust me if your intentions are pure everything is going to work out you know i gave it my all and the universe the world mother earth everything gave it right back i got tremendous support nationally internationally from fans from friends it was just beautiful you know and uh, finally here we were november 29th the grand finale it also happened online virtual grand finale and so i am up 5 a.m watching because that was supposed to be 10 a.m philippines time and i'm like wow they did that i mean no we did that i did that i was part of that it was so beautiful i felt like i'm in philippines watching it i mean miss earth <laughs> thank you and so surprise moving on to top 20 is Kenya oh, I remember how he said it oh from the world world capitals I know from the world world I don't know but he said world world something Kenya oh my goodness I cried a little yeah but I cried now let me tell you what that means Miss Earth was founded in 2001 that's when the first edition happened in 2002 Miss Kenya, Winfred, became number two. That is first runner-up. So, a okay, first. A short while later, the winner was dethroned. In pageants, number two, the first runner-up, 
automatically becomes the queen. So Winfred became the queen. Yay! And she had a beautiful year, beautiful reign. So after 2002, let's count. And three and four and five and six and seven and eight. And 18 years later, Kenya did not place. Kenya did not place anywhere. Yeah, we got awards and all that, but we did not make it to the semi-final. And so here we are, 2020. Mama, we made it. Yo, I cried. I cried. If you watched, you would have cried too. <laughs> After all the hard work, the sacrifice, it paid off mine. I was so, so happy. Um, and yeah, that happened. Uh, that's the farthest we went, but it was a blessing. A blessing. And this whole journey has been a blessing. It has opened up opportunities and doors I never thought would open. I mean, I knocked on doors and they flew wide open. It was a blessing in disguise. So that's the farthest we went. But we also got the awards. One, we got a gold medal award for the talent competition, Dance Africa. Yay! Katoto kadogo kadogo laki ni kana jua kupinda mgongo. Eh! Yeah, guys, I'm a dancer. I think maybe, okay, if you don't know that I'm a dancer. And yeah, and it had a beautiful story uh, to it. I think I told you a bit about it. But I guess I'll be doing more videos on my Miss Earth journey, detailed videos. Yeah, call it a documentary or something. I don't know. But this is, I'm just checking in quickly. So now time. Yeah, that was beautiful. I was so happy. Yay. Um, and also, all right, are you sitting down? If you're not sitting down, kindly do, because this is a big one. Miss Earth, as I told you, is a pageant with an environmental advocacy. And so, our theme this year was Eco Angel. We had to make a costume that represented an eco angel, you know, with wings and all that. So after a lot of thinking and trial and error, I ended up hand designing and making a costume out of leaves, you know, green leaves, like plucking leaves and making a costume. I mean, the submissions were amazing. We have 80 delegates from all over the world and uh, the submissions, the costumes were wow, amazing, beautiful. And then, are you ready? Eco Angel costume winner goes to Kenya Frida Karaoke. Wow, just wow. Honestly, out of all the things, I did not see that coming. First of all, they didn't tell us that they're going to award the best. I didn't see that coming. Honestly, I didn't see that coming. I mean, wow, wait, what? Did we just win that? Ah, man, ain't God great. We serve a living God. <laughs> Yo, that was like the best. That's my highlight of the whole competition. And they say, man, thank you, God. It was beautiful. It was I don't know. I was speechless just how I am right now. So that's the update on how I performed at Miss Earth. And if you'd want to follow that journey of Miss Earth 2020, you can always find the videos. Remember, it was a virtual pageant. So everything is out there online from the beginning to the end. And also, if you want to watch the beautiful coronation night, you can watch. Okay, was it night or I don't know, day? You can watch on YouTube. Follow Miss Earth on Facebook, uh, on YouTube. You'll find all the videos there. So, yeah. For that, I really need to thank uh, a few people. Let me start with Miss Earth Kenya Organization. Thank you for choosing me to carry this flag of, of Kenya. Thank you for trusting me to do the work to represent my country. I am honored and thank you for the platform. Let me thank Kenya Wildlife Service, KWS, I shot most of my videos at the National Park. Mr. Dadacha, thank you. Let me also thank um, Le Villa Resort and Spa. 
Limax Suites, Kikuyu Forest, um, Upper Kabete High School, uh, for believing in me, for trusting me, uh, you know, supporting me as a youth. I shot most videos in several places where I've mentioned. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, Kenya National Archives and Documentation Services for supporting me, um, partnering with me to do my videos. Um, archives. Inside archives is a whole museum. Guys, you, you have to visit that place. I mean, it's affordable once they open up. For locals, they think it's around 50 bucks. So you need to go and learn about all the rich culture and traditions that we have. Thank you. Let me also thank you, my fans, my supporters for your wow for your support all through my family my friends for your support your prayers i really appreciate just thank you to you who i can't say like personally we don't even know each other but you supported me thank you thank you so much from the bottom of my heart thank you you can also read about this what i've just said on my blog noni worldwide you can check that out and last but not least i would want to thank the lord almighty for the support for the favor for the love for the providence i mean everything everything for me this journey is just so god you know <laughs> wow wow the kenyan in me so yeah the whole journey was just god at work so thank you thank you god so what next um i mean i'll continue doing uh, what i've always done my environmental projects um i'll continue doing youth empowerment women empowerment and everything i believe in if you'd want to work with me you can contact me uh we'll see how that goes in case of anything um contact me if you have questions you would want to ask me i'll i'll answer them gladly about the non show I know I've been getting questions about that and yes, we will be back bigger and better. We are working on it. Be patient. Good things take time. <laughs> We've come to the end of this video. Thank you for keeping it here. If you haven't subscribed yet, you already know what to do. Click on the button. Keep safe guys. Wear your mask. Sanitize and wash your hands regularly. Keep your distance when you're in public. And also remember to count your blessings one by one. It's the little things that matter. Until next time, my name is Donnie. Keep safe. Bye.